Now here's what you need to do in case your Apple Watch doesn't receive a text messages. At first, you should know whether your Apple Watch doesn't have access to any messages at all or it just doesn't receive the notifications for them. To check it out, you need to go to your Apple Watch menu and open up the messages app. In case you see all the latest texts and uh, all of the latest messages from your iPhone are also visible on the Apple Watch, then it's okay, everything is synced, and then the only problem is not receiving notifications. But if you cannot even see the messages here, you should make a couple of things. Of course, at first, you should make sure that you update your uh, Apple Watch and iPhone to the latest operating system. Like right now, the watchOS 9.1 is available and perhaps you're running something like watchOS 8 or even 7. So make sure that everything is up to date. Then you should also check out if you have the same Apple ID on your Apple Watch and on your iPhone because it has to be paired. You have to be connected to the same iPhone. So you need to have running the same Apple ID on both devices. That's how you can actually sync it. Well, the syncing of the messages is automatic. So uh, you just can see it right away. And if something doesn't work, if you just don't get to see your messages, something is wrong with the connection between the Apple Watch and uh, iPhone. The way you can check it out and make sure that your Apple Watch runs on uh, the same Apple ID is by going to the settings on uh, the watch and then uh, tap on your name. You can see your Apple ID there. You can even see your name, phone numbers, email and all the stuff. So you need to check out and make sure that you're using the same thing. Of course, the Apple Watch is an extension of your iPhone. So if it's paired and in a range, with your iPhone, then you're gonna get uh, the uh, text messages mirrored automatically. And yeah, in order to make sure that it's the same phone number and email for the Apple ID and the iMessage. So in the settings, go to messages, send and receive. You can see two addresses. So the phone number and email has to be the same as the one on the Apple Watch. That's how you know that you're on the same thing and it sh you should be reachable on both devices. But still, if something is wrong, make sure to reset iMessage so you just turn it off and wait a while and turn it back on. It's just gonna reset at the iMessage. It's not a big deal, but it's just something that you need to try out. But what I think that is the most likely scenario is that in the Messages app, you can see all of the text and everything is there, but you're not receiving the text messages notifications. And that's a different story. For this, you're gonna have to go to the Watch app on your iPhone. It, of course, has to be the iPhone that you are paired to. So you're gonna go to the Watch app, and here you can go to the notifications right away. So you can see right here, make sure to go to the Messages and turn on a mirror my iPhone. But mirroring my iPhone is just doing a, or using the very same settings as on your iPhone. So if you tap on custom, make sure that you allow notifications with sounds, haptics, repeated alerts, everything as you want. But just more importantly, make sure that allow notifications is on. Then also make sure that you're not in the airplane mode, that you have Wi-Fi turned on or that you are in range with your iPhone. You can see iPhone is connected and is nearby. So the green icon just confirms it. But for example, the work mode, uh, work focus is enabled, which pretty much means that it's going to limit my, my notifications, including the messages. So right now I'm not gonna receive any messages. So this is also another reason why you may not be getting them. So it really depends on the situation. So make sure that if you have a cellular Apple Watch that you turn on the cellular network that you have access to the internet if your iPhone is not around or more, the best case would be that you are connected and nearby your iPhone. In this case, you can make sure that you actually get the notifications. So that's just pretty much everything what you can do. Well, in if this doesn't work, just make sure to reset your iPhones, like unpair your Apple Watch. Of course, this resetting is going to require a bit more time and you may even lose your data if you don't back up all of your devices. But this is something that you're gonna have to do at least just restart your iPhone, restart your 
Apple Watch to see what's up. But these uh, settings for the notifications for the same Apple ID numbers, iMessage resetting, this should definitely work. At least some something from the list should work. So hopefully it does. If it helps you, leave a thumbs up and yeah, see each other in the future.